he loved the ability um, to, to be a firefighter. And now he's no longer with us. Good evening. I'm Mark Maxwell. And I'm Jen Lask. Champaign firefighters are mourning the loss of one of their own. Earlier this morning, Trevor Herderhorst lost his battle with stage four lung cancer. He served the Champaign Fire Department for the last three and a half years. WCIA 3's Jared Farmer is live in the newsroom. And Jared, this is a major loss for the department. Jen, firefighters I spoke with say he had an enormous impact in his time there and the department is better off for having someone like him serve. In the fire service, you, you have people that, you know, they do their shift and go home. He was one of those guys that just, he wanted to be at the firehouse around the clock every day. And Trevor Herderhorst dedicated most of his life to fighting fires. He volunteered in his hometown department in 2005 and joined full-time in Champaign 13 years later. His crew members say he always looked for ways to make the station better, like training new firefighters. He never had a question about the things that Trevor was passionate about, right? He, he loved firefighting. He loved the ability um, to, to be a firefighter. And he was a member of all different kinds of groups, not just uh, through the CFD, but also he, he lived firefighting outside of the department. He was known for loving three things, family, firefighting, and baseball. And he was a coach for his son's little league team. And to see someone like Trevor um, in his situation put so much into those things that he enjoyed was, was really great to see. Doctors first diagnosed him with throat cancer back in 2014. Then lung cancer came next. His crew members say even as his situation became grim, he remained a positive force in the department and a person whose impact still serves as an inspiration. I, I talked to him just last week and it was still a very upbeat conversation that he was looking forward to getting back to work. The fire department is helping raise his family money for his funeral expenses. If you would like to donate, you can do so by checking out our website, WCIA.com.